Hello everyone, happy to see you here and in this video we are going to do a very simple math problem and you are going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. And I don't want you to use your calculator right here because here is a problem as you can see 10 plus 28 divided by 2, nothing hard, yeah? And of course most of you out there are like yes I can handle this problem, I can handle this, this is basic, this is basic addition, basic division, I learned this stuff in the third grade so I can easily solve it. And I suggest you like go ahead and write your answer into a comment section, we have option A, B and C, so really interesting options and we have this question right here so you can easily test your algebra skill and your you'll like math, math skill right here. Okay, because obviously whatever order we select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem. And But before solving this, I want to write this solution right here. So 10 plus 28 divided by divided by 2. Okay, we have this question. But before solving this, I'm going to show you this obvious solution right here, because a lot of students solve it in an obvious way, because they say, okay, 10 plus 28 equal to 38, and we have this division, so divided by 2 equal to equal to 19. Yeah, and a lot of students say, okay, we have 19 right here, this is the obvious solution, this is the first option, of course, right here, this is the obvious solution with this addition, so option A is correct, and they go they go to the next question, yeah? But before solving this, I'm going to show you this PMDMC order of operation, and let's look at this order of operation real quick. I want to read this question, so 10 plus 28 divided by 2, yeah? Okay, let's solve it according to PMDMC, because if you look at the PMDMC, what is the first step according to PMDMC? This is the order of operation, of course. The first step of PMDMC is parentheses, and now we need to scan. Are there any parentheses right here? No, I don't see any of those, so let's go to the next step. What about exponents? So are there any exponents right here? No, I don't see any of those, so let's go to the next step. Are there any multiplication or division sign? Let's look at it. Right here, addition, yeah, we have this division sign, so we need to start from this division, and this is this it's changed everything because right here if we start from division we have like 10 plus 28 divided by 2 equal to equal to 14 yeah so it looks like 24 is a correct answer but if we look to the options right here we have 19 this is not equal to 24 we have option c is not the same as 24 we have this for factorial and a lot of students maybe don't know about this factorial and they say okay we don't have this option and we go back to this 19 which is which is a correct answer as they say like that yeah but i want to show you this solution that uh, this case that this solution is absolutely in correct because this is maybe the main obvious solution, the main obvious way how can we solve it, but a correct answer is 24. But then then we don't have this option right here. What about a correct solution to this problem? 19, this is not the same as 24, we have 30, not the same as 24. And then let's look at this 4 factorial, because we know that 4 factorial, doesn't matter, 4 factorial 3, this is a product from 1 to this number, until this number, yeah? And let's look at it, we have 1, times 2, times 3, and times 4, which is equal to, like, we have 2 times 3, we have 6, 6 times 4, yeah, we have 24, so 4 factorial, this is the same as 24, but 24, this is our answer, so we can easily say that our answer is our answer is option, option B, so very tricky moment, and don't forget about factorial, which is really important, uh, exclusively in our in our question, yeah? So this is a correct solution to this problem. And a lot of students go back to this 19, because they see it in an obvious way, this is an obvious solution, they go from left to right, and they forget about a correct order of operation, which is, of course, PMDMC, Bodmas, and a lot of order of operation, doesn't matter, of course, what order of operation do you select, but then you have a correct answer, because every Every time multiplication or division, this is before addition and subtraction, which is really important moment. Of course, if you made this error, I'm happy you made this because you won't make this again. And I, 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 I hope your answer is the same as mine, which is really interesting. And I hope you enjoy this video real quick with this relaxing algebra problem. And definitely, I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventure. Thank you for your time and have a great day. See you in the next videos.